Investigators arrested 10 people and seized illegally modified air guns among huge amounts of weapons in Hong Kong this week. Uh, there were also axes, a launcher for smoke grenades, knives, body armor plates, thousands of pieces of lead ammunition, etc. Reports say the case was cracked after a Hong Kong customs inspector found a gun hidden in an airmail parcel sent from the United States. I guarantee this won't be covered by most international media because it doesn't fit their narrative. But the truth is, this is a key part of the real untold narrative of Hong Kong. Hong Kong people deserve the truth be told about our community. Quick recap, here's a, a fraction of what investigators have found since July 2019. Tsun Wan, TATP explosives, slingshots, ammunition, knives and incendiary bombs primed and ready for use. Four tan smoke bombs, fuses and to get past our community's tight gun control laws, several sets of bows and arrows. Chinese U and Poly U, 600 weapons, 8,000 Molotov cocktails, and an entire petrol bomb factory. I was on the inside of that one myself. North Point, a semi automatic gun, 105 bullets, and five magazines loaded and ready for use. Wan Chai, radio controlled explosive devices strong enough to collapse buildings. I could go on and on, there's loads more, but you get the picture. Why is that side of the story not being told? Because if it was, Hong Kong's security law would make perfect sense. And it's absolutely crucial to the Western narrative that it doesn't. Be smart, stay skeptical, be wise. Goodbye.